is nitrogen tribromide polar? The answer is yes, even though the bonds that hold the molecule together are generally nonpolar. Now, when I say that, I mean the difference in electronegativity between nitrogen and bromine is about zero. It depends on the periodic table that you're looking up electronegativities on. Sometimes it's 0.1, which is small. Sometimes it's actually exactly zero. A difference in electronegativity of about zero means that each of those bonds are nonpolar. I'm gonna write the word bonds there to be specific. But that doesn't mean, like I used to think, that the molecule itself is automatically nonpolar. If you think about the geometry around this nitrogen, it's actually tetrahedral. You have this tripod of bromines that the molecule is sitting on, then you have this lone pair on the top side. A polar molecule has to have a symmetric distribution of electron density. Any asymmetry means that the molecule has some amount of polarity. These three bromines kind of cancel each other out a little bit, at least in like the left-right directions, although they are all pulling downward, if you want to call it that. But this lone pair here has nothing to cancel out with. There's no other lone pair on the bottom side to cancel out the pull or the negative charge density that that lone pair brings. So if you looked at the dipole of this, you'd see that there's a big zone of negative charge here. There's some zones of negative charge here for the covalent bonds, but overall there is a dipole with its negative side pointing to where the lone pair is. The point I'm trying to get at here is, generally if you have a lone pair on the central atom, it will probably be polar unless you have a second lone pair on the exact opposite side as the first one. There has to be a perfectly symmetric distribution of electron density, and a single lone pair on the central atom throws all that into disarray and makes it a polar molecule, no matter how nonpolar the other covalent bonds are. Thanks for being with me, and best of luck.